Today I'll be showing you a brief tutorial on how to connect two PPR pipes using an electrofusion water machine. Measure the insertion depth and mark it on the pipe to remove the oxidized layer. With the scrapping machine, remove at least 0.2 mm of the outside layer. After removing the outside layer, clean the pipe after scraping. Unscrew the pipe holder to fix the pipe, so it stays stable during the welding process. Sizes from 63 mm to 200 mm. Simply adjust it depending on the pipe size by unscrewing and adjusting the pipe to the desired size. Now that we have fixated the pipe, we will begin with the welding process. Open Electrofusion Welding Machine. The machine interface has three options. Setting, Welding, and Printing. Remove the waterproof safety cap and insert the copper heads of the welding machine. There are two options to setting the fusion parameters. First is by setting the fusion parameters manually. Second is by a welding machine scanner. Each fitting has a sticker or a barcode. After setting the parameters, press escape button to return to the main menu. Press the welding machine option. Make sure that the parameters are set correctly. Then press OK to start the fusion. Here, you can see the time remaining for the completion or the welding process. After completion, the machine shows you the cooling time needed. The socket is now really hot. The temperature is approximately 200 degrees inside. And now, with the heat, the two pipes have been welded together. All we have to do is now wait patiently for it to cool down so we can remove it. After waiting 30 minutes, the welding sockets have cooled down and after we have removed the clamps, uh, the welding process has been finally complete. And that is how the electrofusion welding process works. Thank you for watching.